we're continuing the video. I had to stop the video because, you know, I have to pay attention when I'm going up into the middle of the damn clouds and coming back down. This fog is no joke. Shout out to Destin and the West Coast. Boy, I hate this fog. Y'all don't understand. I do not like bridges. And to go up into a bridge in the middle of a fog is like, ah. Uh, but anyway. I digress. Get back to the conversation. So we all can have multi-million dollar businesses, but you have to be prepared to layer on the expenses and the responsibilities that come with that. Shout out to the person on the bike going up the bridge. I am not, I don't know how he doing that one. Whew. My nerves are still jacked up, y'all, but I'm going to be okay because one thing about Miss Moore, I might be shook, but I'm going to do it anyway because I'm about my bag now. I'm about my business. And that's how you got to be. You know, shout out to all the guys that's pushing out the numbers and doing their thing. But the reality is transparency needs to come to the table. How much profit are you really making? How debt are you? How deep in debt are you? And how are you able to get that? See, some of us know how to sell high, have profit, and flip and dip the, the sales that we're making. Like there's a way for you to make money off the sales that you're actually making right now. You feel me? Like people don't understand this stuff is a game. That's when business gets real. Cause your money should always work twice as hard as you do. This is a fact. You should never be working harder than your money. That means you have to, when you make the money, you gotta put it in the right places. You gotta use it as a tool. And if you do have debt, debt needs to be a tool. It needs to be good debt. But that's a different conversation. Like I said, master where you are in your one-man shop. Master the phone calls, master the quotes, master the parts, and master the diagnostic. Master the workflow, master structuring schedules, and communicating with your customers, and you'll be phenomenal. But remember, People with multi-million dollar businesses, there is a price that they pay. You feel me? Time from their families. I'm not knocking anybody hustle, but I'm telling you, be transparent and tell people the truth. The truth is this stuff costs money. If you're trying to move at that level, you can do well by yourself doing three to, four, three to five calls a day. Even if your average call is four to five hundred dollars you know, a day, you know, me, I prefer to do seal systems, you know, $2,500 average on my seal system game. But then it's not like I don't do other things such as uh, ovens, stoves, uh, dishwashers and things of that nature. But all those are premium tickets because I run my business off of ticket average. My key performance in indicator is ticket average because I am always checking the numbers. I got to make sure we're out here in the field that we are profitable, period. That is no, this not, I'm not leaving and there's no profit involved. That's not how I operate. And that way I can handle any blow, any recall, any comeback, any negative, because I've stored enough profit in the conversation, in the relationship, in the actual ticket and the transaction to be successful. You know, it's a lot of times people in the end of the month with the short end of the stick. They can't pay any of their invoices. They can't pay anything off because they had all their money went running trying to get to this big ticket that you had no profit in anyway because you, you were over your head. So the reality is grow up and do the shit right. That's all I'm saying. Stop trying to be everybody else and be the best you you can be. That's all I got for y'all. Let me get out here and get some more of this cheese and I'll talk to you later.